Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. I love links. Not just link sausages and not just link from Zelda. Like links, hyperlinks, URLs. I mean, it's not so much the links themselves, it's really what they produce or what happens to live on a link or at the end of the link. You know what I'm talking about. You just love visiting web pages just to see what's there. And inevitably, on Twitter, people are sharing links left and right, up and down. It's impossible for me to you know, click on everything. I just don't have enough time. But there are certain links that become more popular than others. And to track link popularity, there is twitterly.com, spelled like that, twitterly.com, you know, URL, Uniform Resource Locator. You can follow me on Twitter, at Chris Perillo there. And as I said, I will follow everybody back. I do the whole reciprocal thing. Even if you're not on Twitter, I think you would appreciate what Twitterly is. Think of it as uh, applying some amount of intelligence to what is already out there. So if you're familiar with the way Dig works, you know, certain links rise in popularity based on how many people vote for them. Well, essentially, you're voting for a link on Twitter by tweeting that link. Uh, you know, right now, I mean, the, the list is, is in, well, somewhat definitive at this point, but it, it uh, changes over time depending on when you're looking at it. Um, since there are how many people on Twitter now? Like, well, who's not on Twitter? That, that's probably an easier question to ask. Who is not on Twitter? And if not, why not? Seriously, there's no reason not to be on Twitter. I'm there. That doesn't mean that everybody should, you know, run and sign up if you have no reason to be there. I'm just saying that it's something you might want to look into because there's a lot of really cool things that people are sharing. And when there is a, uh, a certain amount of people that tend to be sharing the same link, that m really means that this is an important link. Something there is good. It's interesting. That many people are retweeting that link. It, there's something there. So uh, Twitterly is really a service that uh, can serve anybody, whether you're on Twitter or not. And the nice thing is if you are on Twitter, you can actually be a part of the Twitterly service. So if you retweeted any one of these links, your username would show up, your tweet would show up in line. You can be a part of it. I really think that uh, you know being able to uh, do whatever you do on Twitter and to have these uh, services that take advantage of the API uh, give you more information about not just what you're doing, but what everybody else is doing. I think this is this is the future of well, well, the web. I'm not gonna you know put any specific version number on it, but this type of behavior is happening anyway. It's just really interesting to see services like Twitterly.com be able to give you more information um, from the things that we're doing anyway. Again. Twitterly spelled like this. It's easy to use. You just scroll up and down and click a link. It's all about the links or what happens to be on the the end of the link. Well, not the physical end of the link because that, that would be the end of it. I'm saying like the result of, you know, the click that happens after you. You know what I'm talking You've clicked the link before. You've been through the. How do you describe that to somebody who's never clicked a link? How? Try, try, try doing that. Try explaining the action of clicking a link. I obviously cannot do it this late at night or early in the morning as the case might be. I set this topic a couple of hours ago. It's ta How many takes is this guru meditation? I, uh, I I think we're what at take 42? It's been a late, late, late night. My email address is chris at perillo.com. Maybe you know of other Twitter mashups or web services that are out there. It might be interesting to share with the rest of the community community I'm talking about. Of course, geeks.perillo.com. And there's also this chat room, uh, which is typically talking tech. Even if I'm talking about one thing, they are most likely talking about something completely different. Like, and, and, and nothing is ever really off topic, like too far off topic. We're just typically talking tech 24 hours a day, seven days a week here with the live video feed and the chat room at live.perillo.com. We'll see you later.